Well, it is clear what the legal implications for the former president are, but what about the political ones? Yeah, it's a race against time to the 2024 presidential election. One of the big questions, did what happened today only strengthen Trump's base and secure a GOP nomination? Fox 5's Kendall Green takes a closer look. A year and seven months now stand between the announcement of felony charges against former President Trump, who's making another bid for the White House and the 2024 general election. Several of Trump's political rivals within the Republican Party have already made up their minds concerning his indictment well before Tuesday's announcement, calling out Manhattan's district attorney, Alvin Bragg. This guy is doing politics. He has an agenda. That is not the rule of law. Their stance is clear, but the path to defeating him in the Republican primaries beginning in February are muddy. This complicates the situation for you. Um, Donald Trump has a lockhold on the MAGA base of the Republican Party. The latest polls show the former president's lead within his party growing, leading DeSantis by nearly 30 percentage points among GOP primary voters since the indictment. As his campaign claims it has raised $10 million. So you're in the bind. Alan Sanders, professor emeritus of political science at St. Peter's University, believes the support garnished from the indictment makes the uphill battle steeper for potential Republican hopefuls like Mike Pence, Liz Cheney, and Nikki Haley, who are all polling in the single digits. You've got to appeal to the MAGA base, but you've got to appeal to a broader segment of the American population, and the two don't mix. I have no comment on that. <laughs> President Biden hasn't made an announcement for re-election, but he's left the indictment alone ahead of a potential rematch against Trump in the general election if he chooses to run. There's nothing to say that would help Biden one way or the other. With more investigations with Trump at the center, the next development in this particular case in Manhattan could be hushed in the headlines between now and his next December 4th court date. Kendall Green, Fox 5 News.